Yeah, absolutely. It's been just one hit after another for local fans as well as out of town visitors. Just a string of high profile events canceled and postponed today, including right here at Globe Life Field, where we learned opening day of the Texas Rangers has been pushed back at least two weeks and possibly even longer. Crews are putting the finishing touches on the new Globe Life Field. Rangers fans around the Metroplex are going to have to wait to see it as Major League Baseball is pushing its start date back at least two weeks because of coronavirus concerns. I'm from Arlington, so I've been suffering that heat <laughs> watching Ranger games and I was ready for the AC and all of that. And so now that we have to we have to wait on it, I guess I, ho I, mean, I hope it's not too long. The Thursday afternoon decision was the latest in a string of changes that started with the American Athletic Conference Men's Basketball Championship, called off less than two hours before tip-off at Dickey's Arena in Fort Worth. To protect our student-athletes was our highest priority, and we felt that there was no way that, that we could really defend you know, playing the games. Dickey's Arena will miss out on 11 games originally scheduled through Sunday. Student athletes like these members of Temple's basketball team were left wandering downtown Fort Worth. You hate that, but, but you realize that your, your first priority is always the health and safety and well-being of your student athletes. So no basketball, but players and fans could still see the sights, at least some of them. Because Sundance Square canceled all of its events through March 31st. No one told you that. And the Chris Stapleton concert scheduled for Friday at Globe Life Field has also been postponed. It's, it's sad. I mean, people have pl made plans and trips and, you know, everything's changed now. So it's not only uh, affecting the people, but the economy. For now, fans in the Dream City and the Gateway to the West are seeing more closed doors than exciting events. I think everybody's safety is more important right now than, than sports. And this is coming from a big sports fan right here. So, hey, it is what it is, I guess. Now, I did reach out to both the Fort Worth and Arlington Convention and Visitors Bureaus. Both tell me right now, quite frankly, it's just too soon to say what kind of an impact all of this is going to have on the local economies. Live in Arlington, I'm Eric Alvarez.